Good morning, good morning everyone. It is Ashlyn's birthday. That just popped up on my phone, which I already knew. But today is Ashlyn's birthday. I'm going out to get bagels um, for this morning, which I already asked. That's uh, She said that's what she would like. And then I'll be back here because I have class at 10. Welcome to year five of daily uh, vlogging. Uh, Seven degrees Fahrenheit outside right now and a jacket sweatpants on because I'm delivering for Uber Eats today too but the high is like 75 so I've got a long sleeve shirt on but it's one I can push up the sleeves on um, so yeah and then today really have to start on my website I am running out of time um, I have what like 12 days 12 days to do this that is not a lot of time but I will do it. Um, oh, let me tell you the exciting news from yesterday. Okay. So, the exciting news is, I don't know if you remember, before I left for Disney, I had a, I had two auditions that I had to film, and one of them was the one that I got that callback for, and then it looked like they were gonna, they wanted to cast me, and then they changed the dates. So unfortunately, I couldn't do it, which was a bummer. But, the other one was for a, um, I gotta turn on the heat, oh my goodness. Um, sorry, that's not what I wanted. Um, the second one was something that I just kinda sorta was like, oh, they must have filmed it probably by now. Okay, whatever, moving on. No, I booked it! So it's a one day shoot that's supposed to be tomorrow. Um, of course they said things could, like the date could change, but I don't think, I hope it won't, cause tomorrow I'm fully available um but yeah so I booked it so that's super fun I play a waitress um it's a really really short it's more like a scene but it's so it's a short film but it's only like one scene so it's one location super easy at a cafe or at a restaurant so I am the waitress and I have lines I'm not just you know in the back so um it was honestly an audition that I didn't like I felt good about, but I didn't feel like, wow, that's one of my best auditions ever. Like not at all. So I'm really, really happy about it. And then I had the call back on Friday for um, the other audition that I did when I got back from Disney. The bagels have been acquired. Hi, it has been a very long time since I vlogged. It is now 8 p.m. Um, but I decided not to deliver today so I could work on my website. And I'm happy to say I think it was a very good decision because I have gotten done a lot on here. Um, I am, I'll show you a little preview. So currently, here's the home page. So screenwriter, actor, casting director, and filmmaker. And down here is all my social stuff. And then if you click the About Me page, we've got a picture of me from when I was th two and a quote that has literally happened. You know what? I'm going to be on TV someday. We got some About Me, which is my longer bio with some photos in between um, with photo credits, of course, and then graduating from college and all of that. And then... This is the folder that for right now only has the filmmaking tab, but is probably the largest tab. Here it is, the filmmaking tab. It's got links to every single film and their, um, it's a synopsis or it's log line. Um, so you, it goes all the way down to cracked. Um, so yeah, I think it's looking really good. It's good. The my work tab is also gonna have screenwriting and all of that stuff. And then there's gonna be another tab for my services. There's also going to be a tab for um, uh, reviews um, that I'm going to ask people if they would be willing to send in reviews that I can put on the site. Uh, I will greatly appreciate. But so far, I'm really happy with it, especially because I have zero design skills. So Squarespace is making this really easy. I am not being paid by Squarespace at all, but I'm really, really happy with this. So I'm super excited. I know I'm excited to keep working on it. I've also gotten my call time for tomorrow. Call time tomorrow on set is 8 a.m., um, so I need to leave here at like 7, 7.15, so that means I get to get up at 6.30. So I need to take a shower tonight, I need to get my clothes together. Thankfully, it's just one outfit. I play a waitress, so it's a very simple outfit. I just need to bring some jeans, black jeans, probably my black dress pants too, just in case. Maybe my khakis as well. They only said two outfit options, but of course I'm gonna bring more because I wanna be prepared. And then a whole bunch of different, um, plain colored shirts. Um, but yeah, so that'll be exciting. Um, 
they said in the casting call, the original one, that we'll really, I mean, it's a three-page thing, so we're really only going to be on set for a few hours. Um, that is if everything goes well. So I'm hoping to be home by, like, early afternoon, um, and I need to write the short film script that Lainey and I are working on. So that'll be my first order of business. If I can't, I'm gonna bring my laptop with me to set, and if I can work on it there, that'll be great. Um, if not, I'll just do it when I get home. Okay, did just have a mild panic moment, um, because <laughs> I just went to go click back on the, um, the backstage casting call for the thing that I got cast in that's shooting tomorrow. I, I honestly right now can't even remember why I clicked on it, but, had totally forgotten that in the description of, like, the thing, it says that all cast and crew um, will be um, required to get a negative COVID test 24 to 48 hours before the shoot. And I was like, wait a second, because they didn't say that in any of the emails, and I had completely forgotten because it was a week and a half ago that I submitted for the project, and it's nowhere in the contract, it's nowhere in any of the emails that they've sent, and it's too late tonight to go and get one done. And so I'm trying to find like where, where I think Walgreens now sells like the test you can do yourself. And so I like, yeah, I'm trying to figure out, I have a feeling they're going to say like, they never mind, like they're not doing that because I'm sure if I forgot, I think all, the other actors forgot too. And someone forgot to send out that information. So I, and I just reread through all the emails and I searched the contract for the words COVID, the words test, nothing showed up. So I just, I texted the point of contact though and was like, SOS. Ah. Right. So potential change in plans. I texted the production coordinator, my point of contact and said, Hey, oh my gosh, I just read this. Let me know. Do I need to run to Walgreens before they close at 10 and get those self tests? Because they don't open until eight o'clock tomorrow morning. And that's when I need to be on set. Um, and so she emailed me back and she was like, Hey, no problem. Um, are you by any chance free on Thursday to shoot at eight? Oh, one of the cats got sick. Um, and I was like, Hey, yes, I am. But I will say if going to Thursday is because of the COVID test, cause this is when I beforehand, I was like, I don't really know where I would run to get one, but I'm trying to find one. I was like, if it's because of the COVID test, I just found I can run to Walgreens before they close and get one. And she was like, no, 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 it's a production issue. Um, please stand by while I check with other cast. So I was like, all right, cool. I was like, do you want me to run to Walgreens or not? But she didn't reply to me. So I'm assuming that's a no and it's not a major point for them. Um, so with that being said, I need to text Lynn and say, hey, there's a potential I may be on set for a few hours on Thursday. So I can either A, because I will get confirmation by tonight if I'm shooting tomorrow or Thursday, I can either A, if I'm shooting on Thursday, come in tomorrow and work normal hours, or I could come in on Friday in the morning, but then I have to leave because I have a callback, and then I could come back after the callback, or I could just head to work after the callback, whichever one, um, or I could come to work on Thursday because the shoot should only be three to four hours, and I can come to work after that because it's starting at eight, so I should be done by like noon or one. So anyway, I need to text her and be like, hey, things are changing, um, what do you prefer? <laughs> I am going to bed much, much later than anticipated because I am not on set tomorrow. I am now on set on Thursday. So I will be getting a COVID test tomorrow um, and I've switched around my work. So I'm going into work around 2.30, working for a few hours. And then on Friday, I will go into work after um, my call back. So um, very exciting, very exciting week. Um, it was a very, very last minute change. So I'm glad I wasn't asleep yet, which it was still fairly early. Um, but yes, I'm heading to bed, so thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. All my social media is in the description. Love you all.